Hey, what's going on everybody? This is Polio Jr. Uh, and this is going to be a very brief uh, video on how to actually add your YouTube um, subscriber count, your live subscriber count, to your actual web page itself. So this is the actual site you would go to. So I'll do my best to pronounce it. I will leave a link in the description. It is akshatmetal.com and then slash YouTube dash real time. Also check out um, just the regular site because um, I believe it's a he has a lot of uh, really cool different um, different projects that, that he's working on that are actually very beneficial. But this is just one of them that just makes it super easy for anybody to add uh, their YouTube live subscriber count to their web page. So what I'm doing right now is just showing you the difference between this and obviously I'm just showing PewDiePie just because this is always fluctuating it's continuously going up but they're right on par with each other so it's definitely accurate comparing his to um, to social blades so they're right it's right on par so uh, if not even a little bit more on the real-time aspect than social blade but anyway uh, so let's go back in here and close that out and so that's the web page you're going to go to it's going to show you some somebody's random uh, YouTube channel at the top so you, what you would do is just search for your name and I'm going to search for my YouTube account name Polio Junior DIY yeah I wish that was mine but <laughs> so this is where I'm at right now with my uh, live subscriber count with YouTube and then from there um, what we do is just scroll to the bottom ba -ba 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 -ba, and you can share the link and it just brings people to this actual page but if you want to actually put it on your website, it says you can also embed the live subscriber counts for any channel, blah, 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 right here. So, and this is just an HTML code. And it's the same code that you would put for any, uh, if you wanted to embed a YouTube video onto your website, it's the same exact code. It all starts with that um, less than sign iframe. So you would literally just copy this and whatever platform whatever platform you're using this is very universal as long as you can get into that html section so you can put it anywhere you like anywhere between the beginning of what's called the body and then the and before so after the beginning of the body and then at the end of where it says um at the end of the actual body of the html page that you're trying to put it on long story short find the <laughs> find the page you want to put on now this is what mine looks like so and that was all I had to do was just literally paste it in there and then I saved it and now I go to polyjr.net and it's just right there uh, at the bottom so very simple very easy um, mine doesn't fluctuate as much obviously as like a PewDiePie channel but <clears throat> if I were to let it sit there you know I would definitely see it move but I'd have to sit here for a very long time <laughs> or, or off for something in, something crazy. But that's just a very simple way on how to actually have your live uh, YouTube subscriber count uh, on your web page. So like I said, it's universal. It doesn't matter what um, whatever you're using to edit your, um, your web page and so forth. As long as you can get that actual, as long as you can get this actual uh, HTML code in there, you are good to go and just adjust it however you want so you can always adjust the, the width and uh, the height all that fun stuff but yeah very simple very easy and that's just to show you that it actually works so this is actually poliojunior.net and it's there for whatever reason <laughs> but still pretty cool so big shout out to um, Akshat Mittal <laughs> I hope I'm pronouncing that right who has a lot of uh, other things like I said, a lot of other projects that um, that he's been working on. So, um, yeah. So he's a yeah, developer and designer. So I know you didn't come here for this. You just came here. But check out check out Akshat's uh, page here because he has some very beneficial um, what you want to call programs and things that he's working on that would be very beneficial to um, you know to a lot of people. But um, yeah, so that's all. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Later.